this is the other layout so we have seen a reporting wizard now we will dive deeper and start with our new uh, empty report so let's uh, how, how do you go to a new report so one option is from welcome screen you can click on new report that will take you to empty uh, report window or else you can click on new control n so it will uh, create empty report and the canvas is uh, of yours whichever way you want you can put elements so let's so now this new report is open you can see in the center uh, canvas page header report header details are there and the report is empty on the top you can see main toolbar below tell, main toolbar there are toolbars sorry on uh, menu bar uh, below menu bar there is toolbar and this arrow green arrow you can see which is typically used to run execute the report not only report this is standard across all Pentaho tools to execute your data integration job transformation again the same similar type of button will be there on that uh, UI so you'll have to use it to execute rest of the uh, tools as and when we are working on the example you'll be fam getting familiar with below the toolbar there is tabulated view as you can see there are two tabs open untitled report and untitled report one if the report uh, name is same then it will keep appending one two three four chronological order then on the left side you can see the palette of uh, elements so these elements you can drag and drop on your report reporting canvas depending on your requirement you can put it appropriately in respective band whether it is page header element or reporting header, header element or it can be component of details like chart so depending on that you will have to put it in appropriate bucket uh, appropriate band so there are a bunch of uh, palettes available you can see it on the left side then you can see uh, this uh, wherever this red border outline is there that is the portion that particular slide is explaining so just focus on that red uh, bordered portion now this particular slide is depicting the canvas uh, report workspace where that workspace is divided into bands and you can have you can add your custom band as well so within details you can add your bands so band 1 band 2 band 3 and within that band then why why to add band because one band you can assign one layout type so that is why you may need adding band on the right side you can see this two tabs structure and tab uh, structure and data structure pane is used to show exact hierarchy included in the report and data tab contains data related information like what data sets you are using then what are the environmental variables in if it is a uh, data set has query then you you will double click on that and it will open that query as well at the bottom you can see style and attribute two tabs style as name says you can configure formats style sheets on the right side another one is attribute attribute used to configure data mapping so if you want to connect that particular field with uh, proper data which is coming from data tab then this this particular attributes will be used other than data you can also configure uh, styles like you can assign style class which is not available in style tab so few configuration are available in attributes tab. 